All right, so here's where things can get a little tricky. So here's our spoke here. There's a nipple, we got a spoke. The other side is our bend, or it could be a straight pull. Could be no bend here, this is a J-bend. But this nipple here, it basically screws on in regular direction, so righty-tighty. So if I'm gonna unscrew this right now, I'm gonna go counterclockwise, lefty-loosey, and this spoke, or this nipple will come right off, boom. Now I'm gonna go back and tighten, I'm gonna go clockwise, righty-tighty, and that's tightening. Now, when we're looking at this nipple on the wheel, it's actually in this direction. So the mushroom end, which is this lower end, is sitting right inside of your rim. It basically gets caught right inside the rim with this mushroom end. And then this other end, the other side, has uh, squares, uh, four sides, depending on, most nipples are like this. You might have some speciality nipples that have different shapes, but usually it's a square. That's where you're putting your tool. So now I go to put my tool on here, sitting on the rim and we'll transfer over to this guy. So, tool sitting right up here. Boom. So when I go to tighten clockwise, I'm turning in this direction, which means my tool is going to be turning in the same direction. So whenever you get confused, just pretend you have a, maybe a screwdriver down here at the bottom. That means my tool is gonna to be turning this way. and be going in this direction, just like that. That's tightening. Now if I want to loosen, I'm going to go that direction and go this way here. So from the back side, everything looks the same. It's clockwise, counterclockwise. From the top side, it actually flips around. So what it looks like clockwise down at the bottom, it's actually counterclockwise on top and then vice versa. Once you get that down, it might take a little while or some people get it just like that, you'll be golden.